bonus points for chaser Casey Kane. Oh, trouble! Already one lap into it. Denny Hamlin goes around. Jamie McMurray goes around. Almost identical to the Bush race last night. Denny a lot Hamlin. Of damage, isn't it? Denny Hamlin. Yep, that's it. They're gonna. Jeff Gordon. I think Jeff just stopped. I'm not sure he got in it. There's a lot of those guys just quit, you know, when they were wrecking there. So Gordon looks pretty clean. Denny Hamlin's in big trouble. He's got a lot of damage to that car. And BP, this isn't one of those places you can just do a, you know, a patch job and get around this racetrack fast. I mean, it's no. a body, you got to have the body right on this car. I saw Robbie Gordon in the seven car. There we see Robbie Gordon come down and make contact. He gets loose and somehow I think behind him they started checking up and Denny got ran in the back of I'm sure well, what happened the four car Todd Bodine got loose in front of Robbie Gordon I think Robbie Gordon had to check up Denny, oh man Denny Hamlin got turned by the 49 car of Mike Bliss whom Bliss goes head on in the wall Field yeah, Jeff being, Gordon did stop. Field being brought down pit road. Pits are closed. Here's Denny Hamlin. Not much you can do when you get run over in a situation like that. <laughs> he and still get run, run over. Into him. Yeah. On board with Kurt Busch. Sorry, check up, check up. They're wrecking all over the place. Everything's cool behind you. About one high, two low. Spot back up. Just hold on. Hold on right there. Going back up high. Just easy. Easy. That's a, you see him right there? Real good Bob job right by there. the spotter right there. That was a great job, wasn't it? Good job. We saw so many of those drivers. We saw Kurt Busch, Jeff Gordon, Biffle, all those guys stop before they got to the wreck. Very fortunate for some of those guys at the tail end of the field. First caution of the night, five bonus points for Casey Kane. He did lead that first lap. Boy, there was a lot of loose race cars on that first lap. You know, that's the problem. This, the tire that we're, we're, and we'll talk about this all night long, the hard tire. And the right side is extremely hard. They, let, they soften up the left side a little bit. But man, when those things are cold, they really yeah. are a handful. Let's check in with Marty Snyder. And Denny Hamlin has pulled the 11 FedEx car into the garage here at the Lowe's Motor Speedway. You can see the experience of the Joe Gibbs racing team. Obviously, have championships with Bobby Labonte and Tony Stewart. They already have a frame straightener back here. They had a complete crash cart ready to go in case this would have happened. They obviously did not expect it on lap one, however. A lot of damage to the right rear of the car, also to the left front of the car. They're going to try to get those two things fixed and get them out as quickly as they can. I doubt Denny even drops the window net. He has yet to do that so far, but a lot of repairs to make on the 11 car, but it looks very, fairly repairable at this point, guys. Thanks, Marty. So it took a lap before trouble unfolded here at the Lowe's Motor Speedway. Denny Hamlin, one of the men in the chase for the championship, taking a big hit. 